Well, you saw her in that last race, uh, Warwick Lupton has sort of came to a grinding halt. And uh, so we're just catching up with crew chief here, Kerry Mitchell. And Kerry, uh, talk us through the damage, mate. What's, what's going on here? <laughs> well, first of all, you need to look at this. I don't think we're going to get much more value out of that somehow. Oh, look at the state of that. She's uh, destroyed. And that, so that's caught the, um, yeah. the, the, the rudder? Ate the rudder in here. Oh, look at that. When it flew a piece, flew apart like that. Well, all broke around the back of the strut. Bro where, broken that, off. That's where it should be, right? <laughs> it should be. It should, should be attached to the back of the boat. It should be under there. Yes, yes. Oh no, and uh, I said we better, we better um, certainly. So what? That's it. You're gone. It's not like you carry a spare set of that or, or a welder in the back of the truck. Um, we normally would, but uh, I don't think Warwick's got a spare strut strut <laughs> down today. <laughs> so I think it's all over. Well, mate. Uh, Probably going to be on its side in a few minutes, I'd imagine. Yeah, we've, we've just caught up with uh, with Ken over there, and uh, he's he's ready to sit down and have some lunch, mate. So I guess yeah, the yeah. other team can do the same. I can put my jandals on, surely. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, Kerry Mitchell, crew chief for the Annihilator. It looks like their day is done. Always unfortunate when a, a boat drops out, but oh well. You know, Warwick did say it's trophy day today, and it looks like he's got a couple of bits of metal to take home. To the world is uh, yeah. reasonably average. Uh, it's last.